At the end of watching the video, a student would be able to design full subtractor circuit using gates and to explain binary subtraction using full subtractor concept and its circuit visualization. The full subtraction concept can be explained by giving two digit decimal example. In If in any pair of subtraction, the first number is greater than or equal to the second number, then no borrow is required. Otherwise, a borrow from higher position is required as shown here. The number 7 is less than 9, so a borrow from higher position is required. That gives addition of magnitude equal to base value 10 to be added in the first number. That means 10 plus 7 minus 9, that is equal to 8. And the borrow is subtracted from the first number in another subtraction. That means 4 minus 6 is the next subtraction since the first number is lower than the second number. So another borrow is required that gives addition of 10. 10 minus 1 plus 5 minus 6 results as 8 and the borrow is marked since no further addition or subtraction is required. The same concept can be expanded to binary numbers. Here the base value is 2. So a borrow will result in addition of 2 in the first number. Thus, full subtraction can be explained as subtraction of a pair of binary bits. Assuming them as a part of large number that requires also subtracting borrow of lower significant position. In full subtractors, there are three inputs, the input x and y, where x minus y has to be affected and previous stage carry B in and gives two output difference D and B out and B out of borrow. The truth table of full subtractor is shown here. The difference D and borrow output B out is function of inputs B in and X and Y. By using K map, the expressions for B out and D in terms of X, Y and B in can be obtained. It can be observed the expression of D is same as that of full adder, while expression of B out is similar to the C out expression of full adder with one change that the first input X is complemented in the expression. That is X dash here. Based on the expressions, Full subtractor circuit can be formed using a 3 input XOR gate, 3 AND gates and 1 OR gate along with 1 inverter. By observing the circuit, it is similar to the full adder circuit with only one change that inverter is added in X for computing borrow output. While in full adder case, there was no inverter and the circuit output of the circuit was carried. That is the difference between full subtractor and full adder circuit. The full subtractor can be implemented using two half subtractors. The expression B out can be simplified by using Boolean logic. That means it is x plus x or y complement b in plus x complement y. And can be realized by using two half subtractors in this fashion. The references for the video is digital logic and computer design by using Maurice Mano by Maurice Mano and of Pearson Education India and Digital Electronics by GK Karate of Oxford University Press India.